Hello, hello and welcome to Krista Cuisine. Welcome to my kitchen. I am Christelle, by the way. So today, Christelle is cooking us lasagna. Lasagna, simplified, simplified method. It's a simple recipe. Why? Because I'm bringing us these two sauces, okay? Already made sauce. Just to make our recipe quick and easy, all right? Bolognese sauce and lasagna creamy sauce find it anywhere in any stores where they, find, they sell food Ocado, Tesco, San Spirits, these ones I managed to get them from Audi because Audi is a two minutes away from my house so because I wanted to show us how to make a quick one I bought those two okay they will come we will, we will then have to put them with the minced meat <coughs> from this one was from I think from Lidl okay we have this one it's about 750 grams okay we use this minced meat and we use some uh, lasagna papers lasagna sheets okay just stay here don't move and let's get started yes okay as you can see in our pot here we have boiling hot water very hot okay be careful so I took out the sheets from the package and what we're gonna do is put them in the water leave them to boil add in some salt okay we're gonna add some salt and just cover the pot we're gonna leave them to boil not for a long time and then uh, get them to rest in the cold water all right meanwhile we will chop our onions okay so that we can start frying the minced meat also i'm gonna chop the um the spring onions yeah. open the package the pack. in the meantime what we're gonna do as it's boiling that we place this pan here and then we will start frying our onions. Got some oil. Onions in there. This is not all of it. Voilà comme vous voyez là. déplacer ma foi à la je vais rajouter le ragoût notre aroma si vous n'en avez pas beaucoup vous pouvez aussi utiliser le cube magique ou juste du sel là c'est juste parce que j'aime épicer tout ce que je, je prépare alors quand vous rajoutez ça ça fait en sorte que les votre, votre oignon commence à coller alors faites bien attention moi j'épique d'abord les oignons comme ça et puis après je vais renverser la viande hachée donc this one yeah, be careful once you've got your aroma in the here uh, stir them quickly so that they don't stick now I'm gonna pour Que ma poêle elle est vraiment petite ce que je veux faire c'est de tout transférer d'une poêle qui est un peu grande before that
maintenant ajouter I'm going to add the nutmeg and a little bit of pepper black pepper I'm gonna taste the salt okay good I will add in about half a teaspoon. This is a, a um, this is a tablespoon, but I'm estimating. Before what I did put was a teaspoonful, and now I've only added half. Then. When it comes to salt, it depends on you. I always advise not to put too much salt. So here, we're still frying. I'll come back to this spoon. Okay, create some room in the middle. Then open the bottom. them well cook them for about uh, for about five minutes I'll be stirring them for about five minutes okay now I've got my gloves to actually get the pasta the lasagna sheets off the pot remember I did rest it in cold water so that it does not stick together what I'll do is lay them in this baking Thing. Le fromage. Then what we will do now is put the sheets again, do the same thing.
I've used about 450 grams about 450 grams of uh, cheddar, uh, grated cheddar cheese. I use, um, sorry, normally I use the mozzarella cheese. Uh, but yeah, I found this in the fridge. It will, st it will still do the same job. Okay, now is the moment to the oven. About 200 degrees. And then we see how it goes. I'll be checking because I don't know how long it Here we are, we have our delicious, delicious lasagna. It has cooked and about to be eaten. Thank you my people, thanks for watching. Subscribe if it is your first time that you haven't subscribed yet. Your first time for watching us, subscribe for more videos. Thank you and Bye.